Alrighty, my name is Derek and I'm here with How to Tech and today we are going to show you how to convert a pages document into a PDF format document. There's so many reasons as to why changing your pages document into a PDF can help you. However, the main reason is that there are a lot of individuals throughout the world that don't have a Mac or an Apple computer or just an Apple software um, piece or device in general. So when individuals don't have some type of Apple platform, they will not be able to open anything in Pages because Pages is an exclusive Apple-only application. So when you convert it into a PDF format, any individual on any desktop or um, device will be able to open it without a problem. So if you like editing things in Pages, all you have to do is the simple conversion and then anyone can open it. So with that, let's jump right into it. We're going to open up the Pages application, which is right there. We're going to use just a blank template for this one. Click Choose or Enter. And we'll just type in Test Doc just to show that there's something on the document so that you know I'm not just opening up some random document. Um, and then let's save it to make sure, and just in case we want to edit anything else. So we'll go ahead and click File and then Save. And we'll name it our Pages Test Doc. Saving it just to the desktop so you guys can see it. Perfect. There we are. It's right there. I could keep this open. I'm going to close it just for simplicity's sake. So there we go. We have our pages document right there, right in the middle. Um, I always like to create a pages document first, just in case I'm sending this to a publisher or sending it to a boss and there needs to be edits done. If you were to just convert it straight to a PDF and then close the document out and not save it, you definitely would not be able to edit it because it's a PDF format, which you can't type on unless you open it with some other software other than pages. But with that said, we can now convert this pages document into a Word document. So we're going to open that pages document back up. And now to convert this into a PDF file, all we need to do is click File, go down to Export with this little tab so it shows that it comes up. And here are all the different things that we can convert this file to. So we're going to choose PDF. Image quality, I would always go with best. You can go with better or good if you'd like the exporting process to be sped up. However, best seems to obviously work the best. You can also put a password with this document so that individuals need a password in order to open up the PDF. However, for this, it's definitely not necessary. It also makes things a little bit more confusing. Especially if you were to send this to someone that doesn't know the password, then they wouldn't be able to open it. So we'll go ahead and click next. And it's just going to allow you to rename it. So instead of pages test doc, we'll go with our PDF test doc. Save that directly to our desktop again, as you see it pull up right there. Our pages document is going to stay the same. So as long as we save it, which we didn't make any changes, however, we can still save it. And then click that X. This pages document will still exist, so we can go back and edit that one later. But now we have our PDF test doc, which is right there. So we can open that one up. As you see, the application preview pops up, which is what Apple software uses to open up PDF files. And there's our PDF. We have our test doc right there, as you can see the text that we had in pages. And that is the full document. Alrighty, guys, that is exactly how to make a PDF file from pages. If you have any questions, definitely leave them in the comments below. And I'll be here to answer.